Deb is cleaning out our pantry. She has eaten two boxes of the 88 acres bars that we love. We love to share delicious, nutritious, healthy snack ideas with you guys. These um, 88 acres seed and oat bars, Deb cannot stay out of. I've been yelled at for a week now. I can't <laughs> keep my hands off of them. And I needed to save some to share them with you because they They're are so the best. Delicious. As you can see, their seed and oat bars are chewy and gooey and they're so delicious like we said. They are actually made in allergen-friendly bakeries that are free of peanuts, gluten, dairy, and the top eight allergens. They are made from ingredients that we have right here in our own kitchen. That's what I love. No weird ingredients. They are so handy to tuck in your bag and they are absolutely perfect for after you work out. Also, they are made with gluten-free oats, so that's a biggie for me. As you know, I would show you all of the rest of the delicious flavors, but they're gone because Deb <laughs> ate them. Sorry. Deb and Danelle 20 will get you 20%. We have a meeting this morning, well, no, here in a little bit, which is afternoon, with the um, trip planning people. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I have a highlight regarding the Alaska trip that we made be taking with some of you guys. I'm going to put the link here again if you missed it for uh, make sure that you click through this, add your email, and that way you get all the information once we know. Also, we've been laughing all morning because last night I was going to share all of the Amazon um, goodies with you and we had a little visitor. It was Titus. He's our four-year-old grandson and he had a little fundraiser a few weeks ago maybe and it was for flowers so they came in and he stopped by to drop off our flowers it was so dang cute he walked in and he yelled happy mother's day i brought you flowers <laughs> i forgot even another part then he ran into our pantry the little um where the furnace and all that stuff is and he knows we have a big bet i'll show you all of the grandkids know this basket is for them and usually it is huge like this is this is very empty but they all know this is here anyways he went in there and grabbed two treats, which are those little birthday cake things. And he came out and he said, look what else I brought you. <laughs> One of my Amazon finds since I'm standing here in the bathroom, this spatula is so dang handy for any makeup that um, is left in here. When you're down to the bottom, you can get every drop and then just wash it off. My fan is another thing that I use all the time. I carry this with me. It is rechargeable with a USB. It's got a clip so you can clip it on the side of your countertop. This spins all different directions. This is a must have. We just got this in our Thrive order. I am dying to try this. It is um, hearts of palm and they're like lasagna noodles with only four grams of carbs. I can't wait, I'll let you know. I have something to say to her then too. <laughs> Deb's sister is mowing and I thought it was Deb's mom and she said, wait, is mom mowing your yard? <laughs> We just got off of the meeting with the trip people. I, so exciting. The places that we're gonna go and see are so exciting. So what's gonna happen is we've got all of what we're gonna do, like the itinerary, and then she's going to give us pricing. We're gonna figure that out, okay that. And then once we make the trip available, you will have um, the chance to book it. And I do know that there's not very many spots. So keep watching stories to make sure that you know when all of this is coming because we really don't yet.
They are building the um, walls on the ground and the, the plywood. They're putting the plywood, they're framing the wall, cutting out the window, putting the plywood, and putting the outside um, weather mm -hmm. plastic on the outside. And then pushing the wall. I didn't know they did it that way. And my butt is wet on this swing. I just posted that video 32 minutes ago. I just looked. They have, it looks like two exterior walls and then the side ones. This one is the living room, bedroom, and the other one is the dining room, kitchen. I have an update for you coming here in a little bit, but I wanted to finish sharing my Amazon finds um, that I got this, some that I got this week and a few that are back in stock that I've shared before that I love. You know that I'm a huge sucker for white plates. These cute little hors d'oeuvre plates are six by six. Six come in a set. I love them for just things like little snacks. There's two different styles and I will link these here. These white bowls are some that I shared a while ago. We love these. They come four to the set and they're all different. I think that they look really cute out in decor and they add so much texture. I grabbed these for the porch. You get three, three wick. They are natural soy citronella candles. And these will come in really handy because I'm gonna start decorating the porch soon. Also for the porch, I grabbed these little pillow covers. I had already had the um, inserts. I'm sure that you can get them on Amazon. I will link these here. I love them. These are gonna go on my porch swing. These are also from Amazon. They are pillow covers. They are not the entire pillow. I already had the insert. I love them. They're like a creamy, cream, two different cream colors. I got asked about our silverware this week. These are probably 25, 30 years old. I did find them on Amazon. I saw them at my sister's house. She got the newer ones and they are really pretty. They look really similar. Just the end is a little different. This little cutie is available again. Every time I share it, it sells out. This is like a little, uh, it looks like a little wooden spool. It has a USB charge port, so it'd be perfect like in a bathroom or even a side table in your bedroom. These are the little mushrooms that we found or Deb found the other day in the woods and I had a couple people ask how she was going to make them. Dip them in egg, wait, soak them in salt water, right? And then and dip them in egg. She used gluten-free panko breadcrumbs and then fried them in a skillet. She ate hers. Are they good? They're excellent. Salt and pepper. Salt and pepper. door the uh, stairway will go here turn and then up and then these doors will be smaller there's a wall that's going to come here and then there's going to be pockets this is the dining room so there'll be a door i think the doors are six feet wide to go into the dining area and then these are the windows that i was talking about we wanted them really big this is into the kitchen that's the outside kitchen wall that they're going to stand up this is, I'll take you from this way. So this is the utility room, basement, utility room. And here is, here is where the kitchen starts. And then this is kitchen, that wall sits up. There is the little side porch. Entryway again, this is the living area. This is the master. They'll set that wall up. This is the bathroom back there and then a little area. This is the front door, which is what we will be using when we're working outside. So for all who are concerned about how far the bathroom was from the front door, I'm standing in it right now. 
and this is the dining room that we're in and then when you come through this way this is a little office area and then like a desk area here and then there is a pass through here to the living room this is what we wanted large window large window here you can see the sections i'm standing in the garage that's the kitchen dining room entryway living room and then bedroom second story will have just two bedrooms and a bath and that's it 